we made one of these that fits into one of these that does this without poles, trees, or any other high thing to tie onto. And the best thing is that we managed to do it for less than this. Using a cheap 10 meter measuring tape, we cut the tape into two separate five meter lengths. We then remove the paint at the end of each tape measure. We then cut into the tape about halfway and pulled out a little tab. This is for the connection point. Next, we covered each length with copper slug tape. Then, using wide PVC tape, we taped both lengths together. This gave us a driven element that's good for light to moderate winds. Adverse weather conditions? No problem. We simply added cable ties at 300mm intervals. Then, using gardening plant labels and a connector block, we made a ground plane spreader. We sold an ours together, but it can be made using a nut and bolt and cutting a strip for the connector block. Using some old speaker cable, we made four five meter radials. We then put the whole thing together using four plastic gardening stakes, some light twine, two aerosol can lids, and four mini bungees from the pound shop. And last but not least, we added 10 meters of RG58, a PL259 at one end, and at the other end, two times 50 mil leaded crocodile clips connected to the center core and 150 mil leaded crocodile clip connected to the outer core connected like so we soldered ours but it could also be connected with connector blocks mm -hmm.